Hello, fellow humans. This is M Squad One. Today, I am bringing you guys another episode of my Let's Play series. Yes, indeed. Hopefully, you guys are happy about that. Uh, the main reason I'm going to be doing a Let's Play, not a Hobo Nation, is just I have quite a bit of stuff to talk about. So, this is going to be a work talk episode, not really a design stuff. At the end, I'll reveal some stuff to you, show you some progress, but mainly, it's just going to be me working on these tunnels, and I'll explain to you later why I am building these tunnels so far out, because if you guys know, I don't really have anything out here. I have a dark oak biome and a desert. That's it. And so, why am I building them? Well, you'll find out. So, yeah. So, it, it should be interesting. But how you guys doing on this fine what day is today? Well, the day I'm recording this is actually Monday. Uh but the video comes out on Thursday. So how you guys doing on this Thursday? I hope you guys this said good, because I know I'm doing pretty good. And I don't like it when people aren't doing good. We're gonna now run back. Cause I don't like starting at the edge. So it may look like it may look kinda weird what I'm doing right now with the netherrack, but those are just filler blocks. Right here is more what it looks like. But okay, some things I want to talk to you guys about. So first off, I'm very, very excited to be done with camp. I love camp, but I also love YouTubing. And it's really hard to YouTube if you don't have your equipment or stuff with you. So, yeah. That's all oh, that's that. But is my treble on? Sorry about that. There's a weird ringing in my ears that uh, ringing in my ears are mean. But so I'm very happy that camp is over. Uh, I'm also really excited for it to come back. But there's always a but. I'm actually not done with being gone. Uh, this is Thursday, so in like three days, so on Sunday, I'm getting on a bus, and I'm going to Michigan, which for me, that's north. Uh, some people, like people who live in Alaska, that's way south, so, well, more east. But, yes, I am very excited to be here and stuff. And what that con I mean, what that is is it's actually a conference that I'm going to. Ooh, I cannot do two of those in a row. Uh, if any of you guys are familiar with the Boy Scouts of America, there's something in it called the Order of the Arrow. Uh, I am a part of that. Yes, for those of you who are wondering, I am a vigil member of the Order of the Arrow. For those of you who don't know what that is, why did I put a stare there? That's fine, but. <clears throat> For those of you who know who it is, what it is, I am a vigil member of the Order of the Arrow, and yeah. So it, I'm going to the National Order of the Arrow Conference. So if any of you guys are going to be there, hey, I'll be at NOAC, so look out for me. Uh, I probably won't be wearing the shirt that I usually wear, which I probably have a picture right here. that shirt. Um, I wear that shirt during vlogs and stuff, but I won't be wearing that. I'll be wearing my uniform, but if, you, if you're if you really my fan, you'll look out for me. Uh, so, yeah. It should be fun. So I'll be gone for an entire week. After that, I will be back for the weekdays. I mean, uh, yeah, you know, typical stuff like that. But then I will be in town until the end of August, where I'll be leaving for like two weeks, uh, going over to Denver and then to Salt Lake just to visit family and stuff. And then in for the, right before the second weekend in uh, September, I'm actually going to fly back home to where I am now because I have an event that I have to go to. So, 
yeah, that should be pretty interesting. And I'm quite excited for that. So, that's kind of what's going on with me right now. Uh, and besides that, not much has really happened. Uh, I am going to, I do have more to talk about, by the way. Not just that. So, now let's talk about the next thing, okay? So, as a lot of you guys know, the video quality that I am giving out to you guys right now is not the best, okay? And, hey turtles, you mind being quiet? Thank you. Sorry, my turtles, like, they're loud. Yes, turtles can be loud. Oh, I need more yellow. But, I am currently working on getting that mitigated. In fact, one of the main reasons I went to camp is to get money so that I... It's a job. So I get money so that I can go and buy new computer parts. So I get... Oh, burping. So I can actually use my computer for recording. Okay? Now, I'm about to say a bunch of stuff that if you don't know computer hardware it'll make no sense whatsoever. But if you do know computer hardware, it'll understand. Okay, so some things that I'm going to be getting. I'm going to be getting a Corsair. Corsair is my favorite computer stuff brand. And no, they did not pay me to say that. Um, a Corsair H105G, or H105, that is a liquid cooling CPU block. Uh, and radiator and all that fun stuff. Oh, I need to go to the Mesa. So, I will be getting that and so my processor will be water cooled I don't have that really loud stock fan anymore I'm gonna be getting some quiet uh, some Corsair SP120 uh, quiet edition I think fans yeah quiet edition and those will help me with keeping computer quiet those two things and processor cool so I mean it does kind of give a performance boost, but not much. And then I'm going to be getting a, again, Corsair. Uh, what is it? Uh, I think it's a Force XT solid state drive, uh, a 240 gigabyte one. It's a really good SSD. Um, it has like 500 megabytes of read and 500 megabytes of write, you know. It's it's fast and it'll be good and it's Corsair so I'm excited about that and then I'm actually gonna get Windows because right now I'm running Ubuntu 14.4 and for non-computer people pretty much that's Linux it's a Linux distribu and distribution that is not the best for recording and I don't have drivers for my audio for it and it's kind of difficult to you know record stuff without audio so I mean I it's kinda weird because right now I don't think this is actually putting out audio uh, like my computer and I'm playing on uh, it's not putting out audio into the videos but that's actually my headset I might get a new mic if I have the money uh, and so that's those are the upgrades that I'll be doing uh, if you guys are wondering which colored rings I'm getting, if you know the Corsair stuff, I'm going to be using the blue ones. My system's color theme is black and blue. It's really cool. And so I'm going to be getting blue. Now, next summer, I'm also planning on doing some upgrades. Pretty much I'm going to be upgrading everything except the case and the stuff I'm getting this summer. So, I mean, I'll be getting a new graphics card well I, and the power supply is staying the same but I'll be getting a new graphics card probably gonna get a GTX 970 unless something better has come out uh, just cause price to performance it's really the best uh, and then I'll be getting I'm actually going to be going to X99 uh, that's a platform uh, I'm gonna be probably getting a i7 5820 Okay, that's a it's the lowest i7 processor, but or not i7 lowest x99 processor. But for those of you guys who don't know, what you may say like getting the lowest one, it's still 350 bucks, almost 400 dollars sometimes, and so it is not a weak processor at all. It is an i7, and 
it's still better than all uh, Z7, Z97 stuff. So it's not like it's going to be suffering at all, which I like because I don't want to have components that are suffering. And so I'll be getting that. I'll be getting probably, probably, emphasis on the probably, a, uh, what was it? It was an ASRock Extreme 6, the X99 one. Uh, it's a really cool looking board and it's fully functional, has good built in audio, um, great drivers, and it's blue. So it'll match my build. I'll be getting probably 32 gigs of Corsair LPX memory, DDR4, probably uh, 1600 megahertz. Is it megahertz or gigahertz for RAM? I can't remember. But running at 1600. And of course, I'll get the ones with the blue heat sinks. And it's the same blue as on the fans and stuff, so my system will be really cool looking. Like, seriously. I mean, it'll be so cool. Uh, I don't actually know which of the graphics cards I get. I might actually get a R9 290X, or maybe a 390X, but the Sapphire one, because it also is the same blue. Um, I don't know what the blue is actually called. Uh, I could probably find that out. But it's just a really cool color, uh, and I'm excited to actually color code my system a little more. Right now, it's pretty well color coded. I also will be getting some power supply sleeving, but that won't be next summer. That'll be before then, because all the sleeves are black, except the 24 pin. I have a Corsair uh, CM750X or CX750M. Yeah, that's what it is, and. <laughs> It's modular, except the, it's fully modular except the 24 pin and the 8 pin. So I guess I'd be semi-modular. And they decided to make the uh, 8 pin for the or yeah 8 pin, which is for the uh, processor. And yeah, they decided to make that fully black. But the 24 pin for the motherboard is rainbow. Yeah, it's it's disgusting looking. I mean, first world problems right here. I know those are major first world problems. In fact, it's kind of weird talking about them, but I still really don't like the fact that they're that colorful. Now I know some people have put out videos like uh, what's his name, Paul's Hardware. Paul's Hardware just made a really cool video showing how you can paint your power supply cables or something like that. I actually I'm gonna put that in the description uh, just cuz it's a really good video and I enjoy it um, but I'm not gonna do that cuz it does void your warranty I'm pretty sure I think he mentions that in the video that by painting them it will void your warranty and <sighs> warranties cost money you know so I don't know if I'd want to do that in fact I'm pretty sure I wouldn't so, yeah, that's kind of how it's going right now. Um, I have no idea how long I've been talking. Man, I'm going to go check to see that time real quick. Okay, we still have like seven minutes that I can talk. So, and yes, this is a very, very talky episode. And then for that, I am sorry, but we are getting progress done. Um, from now on, I'm not actually going to talk about anything except Minecraft, really. And if you guys want me to talk more about computer stuff, like, if you guys are into that, yeah, sure, I'll do it. Uh, leave it in the comments if you would like that. I am considering starting a tech channel, but of course for that I would need a good camera and stuff like that so that I could actually show off the stuff. Uh, I think it would be cool to have something like Paul's Hardware, or Jay's Two Cents, or Linus Tech Tips. All really good channels if you would like to get into computer stuff, by the way. Uh, but I'm not quite sure if I have the time, money, and skill for that. I know I'm good at computers. I I build systems, you know, all that stuff. But I don't know if I'll be able to do it based on my schedule. So, yeah. But just let me know. Is that something you're interested in? But, okay, now let's talk about Minecraft. 
You guys are probably wondering by now why I am building these long tunnels out to nowhere, pretty much. So, that's actually a funny story. Uh, I had finished the nether hub in there, and I was done with the video, and I said, it is done. Then I realized right after I uploaded it that... Wait... Let me watch the video where I actually say what I'll be doing for the nether hub to see if I actually, uh, yeah, if I actually completed it. Now, that was episode, oh, what was that? Was that like seven? Man, that's a long time ago. I think it was episode seven. And in episode seven, I said that we would not only be building a nether hub, but we would be building five nether hubs. You're probably thinking, like, what is he talking about? Five nether hubs? That, no. Actually, we I did say that. And let me explain how. I'm just going to finish this nether act, and I'm actually going to show you some stuff. So, what my plan was is to have central hub. Central hub will be, uh, it'll be right in the middle. It will be all four of the colors. Yellow red, green, and blue. So, yeah. And then, past the nether, after that, I'd have the other four nether hubs. A yellow one, a green one, a blue one, and a red one. So, pretty much, I said I'm done, but I'm one-fifth of the way done with the main hubs, and it took me like 20 episodes to get that one done. So, what I've been doing is I've been working off camera on some stuff, uh, like these lag spikes. Yeah, thank you, game. Uh, but I've been working off camera on all this stuff so that I could have it ready for when the videos actually start. And so, I think that that's been a good idea. It's really helped out. So, I'll put this part on. Said I'd finish this. Grr. Okay. So there. Then we'll just put the rest of this in. Then we'll go ahead and. Uh, right. Man, look at all the work we've done. Dang. It's actually pretty good. Uh, usually these tunnel, these tunnels are difficult to build. Uh, let me show you what I've done so far. I love this so much. But the other nether hubs, imagine just this green part, okay? So imagine there's green right here, and then there's green right here, and green right here. And you see that orange line? There's an orange, or not orange, red. There's a red line right there. It's all the same color. So yellow, it would have sandstone. Purple, it'd have diorite. Red, it'd have granite. I might actually change the, it from granite. I don't really like granite. Uh, what I'm thinking is, I don't know, and I might change, no, this one looks good, I like this, but the red right, the granite right here doesn't really look that good, but I guess right here it looks pretty cool, so if I had to redo it, I'd switch this to granite and this one to sandstone, but yeah, so, and then I built these tunnels, I've only finished the green one, and these tunnels are the main tunnel, and they go 100 blocks out. And as you can see, we do have the arrows. All of the arrows will point or will point away from here. So this is where we're going to build the next hub. Like, literally right here, I'd be inside of it. So it's right here. This one will probably be pretty difficult with the giant abyss under it. But it's not as bad as red one, because red one is in a giant wall. So that one will be pretty difficult. But these giant tunnels. Then, let's say, let's get into a big space. Oh look, a big space. So, because we'll have central hub, and we'll have hubs out here, uh, so like this. We'll have tunnels going here, connecting them, but we'll also have tunnels going here. You think, well, do you have a hub here? No. Just, no. I might, someday. Uh, that would actually be pretty cool, like, just a green and blue hub, or a yeah, but probably not. Uh, probably what I'll end up doing is just putting 
a small little hub, maybe a tiny hub, but nothing big. It's more of just a meeting point. And so and there'll probably be a portal in there. And there'll be a portal in the big one, pretty much exactly like this. Of course, this part is going to be the same. The orange is going to be in the same places. This part's going to be the exact same with that. Ooh. Um, there we go. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. Uh, I'll be doing a lot off camera. I might actually build one of these off camera just for fun. But I hope that you're enjoying this. And yes, there will be a smiley face. I hope you're enjoying this nether hubbing. Uh, don't worry, I'm going to do other stuff at some point. But this is just what I really want to get done because I have been working on this for almost a year now. And that's kind of crazy to think that I've been working on one thing for almost a year. That's just that's this crazy banana mode but I am enjoying it and I hope you guys are as well remember guys if you like this like the video if you disliked it dislike the video comment down below on the things I talked about get a conversation going I wanna I wanna talk to you guys I wanna have fun so do that and I'll talk to you guys on the next episode so actually I'll talk to you guys after the next episode this next two videos cuz I'll be gone I won't talk to you guys till after that but thank you guys so much for watching, and have a very nice day. See ya.